I am Angela, and this, this is my basement. <laughs> There's a storm coming. Uh, it is a tornado, uh, and the play begins with me running into my basement and locking the door, and then I start to talk to the audience, talk to myself. I am sitting here in this underground shelter, scared into quivering breathlessness, thinking about what is to come. Help me, Hamlet. The fact that sometimes she lies, I felt was, uh, would be fun to, to play, to kind of dig at the truth, what, find out what is the truth. My New Year's resolution to work out more is going very well. Thanks for asking. How's yours? We see into her through her quips and her jokes and, and her um, things that may not, that sound funny, but actually we find out or not really as funny as we thought they were. So this guy with the camera is freaking out and he's going, Josie or Sheila or whatever the hell her name is, in the basement now. We first worked together here in 2002. That's right, that's right. And I actually did my first production here in 1988. Oh, wow. I played Prudence in Beyond Therapy. Oh, wow. So that's how long ago it was. <laughs> and this isn't your first time doing a one-woman show either, is it? No. No, it isn't. I did um, a play called Shirley Valentine um, in 2010, I think. So do you think that that experience doing Shirley Valentine was another reason why you were drawn to this play, to have that opportunity to do this again? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I saw that exact thing happen to a three-year-old in a Best Buy. His mom was looking at a phone or whatever, and this little guy is standing there in front of this wall of TVs. And I see him crunch his little brow and say, not very nice. Huh? <laughs>